So the first match, Heli Mendes is on court, waiting to play Nadine Shaheen. I would say around this area, you know, just to actually take a bit more pace, hit it a bit higher and, and just keep it nice and accurate into the sidewalk rather than blasting away, because Shaheen likes to flatten the ball quite low. You know, when, she, when it's mid-court, she's got that same swing of hitting a length and hits it hard and low and crunches it. Well, Mendes just managing to keep her nose in front, but Shaheen is really starting to speed things up. <laughs> even more if, than if before. If that was even possible. Yeah. But she's it's rushing down. Mendes. There's that quick boast. Out. So Eight. this is the test now. Into the business end of the first game, crucial first game. Sells. That's nice skill at the end of that savage rally. Game ball. So, what are you feeling at the moment? You could see the technique there again with Shaheen. Ball came onto a racket quickly onto the backhand, and it's the flat racket face. She needs time on the ball to be able to play her game accurately. That was quite clever oh. of her. I don't know if she intentionally meant to hold that. I think she was. Clever shot. Yeah, really well played. Rough Excellent seven. squash from Mendes. Mendes. Mendes leads one game to long. I think Shaheen will go and get a new pair of shoes. <laughs> Certainly good for the balance. You see she's got considerably strong quads on her, which is uh, a part of ice hockey. Struggling to get down to those low, hard kills from Shaheen. This is a good comeback hit. Just needs to serve intelligently. Still four game balls, though, with Shaheen. Shaheen slaps her Shaheen. thigh as she goes off court. One game all. Yeah, I mean, she's obviously oh. going to hit that as hard Eight. as possible. But it's all teed up for her now. Oh. The error coming from Mendes, so a little Nine, bit two. stagnant from Mendes. And Shaheen player that just continues to press on. Yeah, this pace is just a bit uncomfortable for Mendes and she's struggling to slow things down. Seven game balls for Shaheen to take a 2-1 lead. She can't serve quick enough. So Shaheen finds Shaheen. the third game even more comfortable than the second after losing the first. It's me. I mean, she's literally marching to the service box. One of those players that <laughs> everything is quick, yeah. slightly not irritating, but just being harried all the time. It's like, just let me get back to ser return serve before you start serving. Yeah, everything's uh, happening I mean, oh. just far too quickly for Mendes here. Yeah. It's got to get a point on the board. It's better. More control there from Mendes. One, five. <laughs> that was uh, ferocious, very effective. 
Yeah, and just harder and lower. It's a good call for a fast nice front ball. wall that Shaheen in overdrive. Seven match balls, and she's just plucked that one out of three. nowhere. Match to Shaheen. Three games so to one. Another victory 10, 12, over Hayley Mendez. 11 3, 11 3. So the number 15 seed booking her place in the second round to seeding with a ferocious last three games. Ruthless, anything with us at the end. 3-1 victory over Haley Mendez, the ever-improving American. Uh, we'll get it here very, very shortly, an interview. And She's out certainly uh, six five. Coming out here very strong, Vanessa. Victor's not looking. It's not looking like thirty two versus seven in this first game so far. We've seen Victor, as you said, her lateral strength across the middle there. She's been putting that on display, and she's getting positions like that where she's able to work the ball short. Well, she's got uh, she's got the ability. She's got the subtleties, hasn't she? As you said, Johnny, I haven't seen Victor play. All that often at all. I'm not sure no. I've ever commentated on her before. Seven five. And all the signs are very good. Can't believe how early she served that into the side off there as well. It's difficult to see. Look, the line, the colour of the line is virtually matching no. the court. No, it's not out. I see the ball is not out. Might want to paint that line red. Ten eight. Game for tomorrow, ball. Vanessa. I mean, you're right. That is. That line is camouflaged into the sidewall. So two game balls for Sobi. Lovely angle from Fichter. Out. 11-8. Game to Sobhi. Sobhi leads. One game to learn. So Amanda Sobi taking that first game is about how, knowing how to close out games, how to win those big points. Down. So I mean, just a little bit too and much out. there, a little Five, bit too four. too much finessing, perhaps, because she got herself in a good position on that backhand there again. Just that. Very good straight dropping here from Victor and hasn't finished it yet. Oh, Sobi's done tremendously oh, well there good. to hang in. One drop too pick many from Victor. Pardon? Yeah, pick up is good. To be fair to Sobi, I think Seven, every six. pick up there was good. Yeah, I'm not even sure which one is being questioned. I thought it was all fine. Sobi starting to move better in this second game. Cross-court kill, we've seen that quite a few times from Sobi. And, out, and ten, set up so seven. much of her game. And she game has board. now put herself in prime position to go 2-0 up. So three game balls for Sobi to take a two-love lead. And Eleven, there it is. Seven game to Sobhi. Sobhi leads two games to love. Deep at times as well, Victor. Still got a lot of spring in her step as well. She looks fine physically. Is that trusty straight forehand drop? She's starting and to find her range. Four, three. Yeah, that was a lovely shot. Just rolled it in. Just get the pins in the right spot. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. Seven, four. Just, uh, fr just freed up a little bit now once she hit that forehand drop early in the game. I just feel suddenly on that left hand side, she's feeling bit more uh, relaxed about attacking. So Sobi closing in now.
10 5 match ball so five match balls for sobi From Fixa. Match to so pay three games to love. 11 8, 11 7, 11 5. So the number six seed, Amanda Sobi, taking that match in 29 minutes. 11 8, 11 7, 11 5. Good pressure, it's that backhand volley drop right. again. No, can't lose anything forward. loose. This young Egyptian really very, very destructive Nine, in that area of the court. Yeah. Oh, what a shot. Good physical rally, she needed that one as well. Hence the screen. Out, nine all. That's what she needs. Good physical rally here for the Belgian number one. Down. It's well played. Very well played. And out, yeah, Abbas just looking a little ragged after that one, Joey. You could just have a look, points. and she's gone for the towel. Each player she seemed to be heaving a little bit. Yeah, I could tell that. The length of this game has certainly uh, suited Gillis as well. That would be a real sort of double blow for Abbas. Well, she struggled yeah, she to find a winner around the middle, but that's, that's certainly going to urge her on now. First game ball for Gillis in this first game. Long testing, and there's the error. So, Nelly Gillis fighting well, Gillis. Abbas, Gillis as Johnny pointed out, physically starting to... ...pounding the effect as well, so Gillis... ...just looking ever so slowly, the more solid player here. No let. Ball nicked out there. Gillis sort of choosing to go for the cross drop option, which was the uh, slightly more risky of the two, but, but it's just not quite organised enough right now. Down. It's another run for. So Gillis is steaming Nine, away here. Six. Yeah, she put the hard yards in and she's reaping the benefits. Lovely Lovely little change there as she just floats that Gillis boast around with a bit of slice. Two games to love. And you hear there, it's the first sort of vocal war cry two. we've heard from uh, the young Egyptian. Big burst, big burst from Abbas. Five all. It sort of circles its way back to her. And look at the uh, sense of awareness about Gillis. You could really, young players see that very, very quick and positive onto the ball. She's doing what she did in game two here, just scooting away. Nine five. This is the improvement also mentally of Gillis that she just knows when to put the foot on the accelerator a bit more these days. She's raced away here. Five match balls for the Belgian. World number 12. Down. And there we go, 11, forcing five, the error. Once again, Three making it hard physically. Nada Abbas crumbling. 13, 11. 
11-6. So Nelly Gillis will be over the moon with that result. Three love, a bit of a run out in the first game. And then pretty, pretty straightforward in the second and third. Just shy of 40 minutes on this glass court. So a great day at the office for Gillis. Three love victory over Nader Abbas. Um, from a technical standpoint, real classic, huge wind-up, heavy, heavy hitting to the back of the court, and then another huge wind-up, and then a softening blow to the front. Yeah, she's got the subtleties in the front, as you could see there. She's got a bit of hold. Four, two. Got to get her stretching out to the ball. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of one-two punches going on here. I mean, that was just a, I'll say, relatively simple. Three. Game balls here for Matwali up her sleeve. It's the first time we've seen Klein just sort of... Game ball. No, the ball was... Uh, there was quite a distance between Klein herself and the ball there, so she was just sort of uh, pushing, but she manages to squeeze it at the back of the court anyway. It takes a very good angle. Notice that in the first match. The ball stays very short. Five, six. She's really uh, got the motors five. into gear in this game and uh, earned five game, game balls to level things up. She's given uh, Matuali plenty to think about. Game. It's just loose on those short attacks on the forehand side and another Number wayward five. error. Klein. One game all. Klein has done tremendously well there. Leveled up to one all. And out. Four, five. Nice. Eight, six. <laughs> Eleven, eight. Game to Klein. Klein leads. Very big uh, cry there from uh, Klein, just affirming all the good work that she'd done, and she did. One does get the feeling she'd have to come up with some pretty outrageous winners. It's not a bad one to start with. Five, seven. And you just can't afford to do that against a player like Matwali, who's kind of got her back against the wall, so she's going to go for it. She's not going to hold back. Yeah, there it is, that little cross Hand flick, up. which has been so effective Nine, for her throughout seven. the match especially when she's had a bit of time and a good look at it. She wraps it up nicely there. Match to Klein, three games to Klein, it was uh, a tricky 11, tussle all the way, and 11, eight, even when she looked 11, like she was going to run away with it in the fourth game, Maxwell's Huge hitting power and uh, ability just to strike winners at, at, at a quick rate. Just sort of uh, kept Klein on her toes, but she managed it very well in the end. 40 minutes, works her way into the second round here.